Hello kids, how are you? I'm fine. In case if you are asking about me. Okay kids, now let's start our unit, uh, our new unit out and about. It's unit 10. Let's begin. Look at the picture. What's the weather like? Good job. Excellent. It's rainy. Can you ask your family members about the weather today? Go, go, go quickly and ask them. Then come back. Okay, kids. Now we are going to talk about something very interesting which is seasons of the year. Can you tell me how many seasons are there in a year? Exactly, excellent. There are four seasons in a year. Okay, now my dear students, my dear students, open your book, page 54, listen and say, rainy, windy, sunny, hot, cold, cloudy, very good, read them again. In your open your student book, page 55, listen, read and say, Go outside. Read a book. Go swimming. Play board game. Play football. Watch movie okay now let's listen to these two girls talking with each other about the weather and what shall they do what's the weather like today it's sunny what shall we do let's go outside Okay, it's your turn now. Ask your family, what's the weather like today? What shall you do? Take notes. Let's talk about your favorite season. What do you like to do? Okay, read the passage below. Then talk about your favorite season and what do you like to do? Do you know, my dear students, that we have five senses and they are touch, sight, taste, smell, hear. We use them to discover the world around us. Listen to the song to know more about the senses.
Now, read the story on your student book page 59 and answer the questions with me. Are you ready? Remember, my dear kids, that each story has characters and setting. And when we talk about setting, we mean place and time. Now, in that, in the story, the previous story, tell me who are the characters? There are two of them. And what is the setting? I mean here, the place. Now, it's for next time. You know what is diagraph? Diagraph when two letters make one sound. Such we have here in page 60 in our student book. It's O and U, O and W. They make one sound, which is ow, ow. Like like cloudy shout both of these words have o u and it sounds ow listen again cloudy shout and also we have owl Cow. Both of these words have OW and it sounds OW. Listen again. OWL. Cow. Okay, now look at the following pictures. Try to guess the animals. Excellent. Super. Now let's read them together. Turtle. Flamingo. Camel. Fox. Snake. Giraffe. Elephant. Crocodile. Penguin. Parrot. Monkey. Lion. Okay, kids, we knew that words can be verbs, which are action words like run, jump, fly, eat, hungry, and so on. They can be also nouns, which are naming words like desk, dress, computer, and so on. Today, we are going to know new kind of words, which are adjectives. What are adjectives? If we want to describe anything, we can use adjectives. Adjectives can be colors, can be shape, can be size, like words we have here. Like dangerous, windy, beautiful, long, thin, rainy, black, small,
Can you think of other words? Adjective words? Make a list of them. Use them. Read and practice. Let's see these two kids. What are they talking about? Okay, let's guess. It's tall and pink. What is it? Is it dangerous? No, it's not. I know, it's flamingo. It's your time now to think. Go and ask your family about an animal. Let's have a competition and see who will know and who will not. Now let's talk about amazing places. I want you to look at pictures on page 64 in your student's book and listen, please. Okay, kids, now I want you to look at these amazing places in our student book on page 64. Okay, and the first text, look at the first text and the picture. It's a picture of a penguin. And penguin, where does penguin live? Where do you think? In cold places or hot places? Yeah, the penguins live in cold places like Antarctica. Let's read, follow me please. Antarctica is at the South Pole. It is very, very cold. There is ice all the time. Penguins live in Antarctica. Okay, now, look at the second picture. Look at the animal. There, what is this animal? Yes, it's a camel. And a camel lives in hot places or cold places. What do you think? Excellent. Camels live in hot places. Very good. Let's read. The Sahara Desert is very big and very, very hot. There isn't any rain. Fennec foxes and camels live in the desert. So, there are many animals live in hot places like camels and foxes, fennec foxes. Very foxes, and I can, and I'm sure that you can think of more animals live in such hot places. Okay, let's read the third text, and it is very rainy in the Amazon rainforest. It is hot too. Monkeys and parrots live in the rainforest. So this place, which is rainforest, rainforest is um, a forest full of uh, tall trees, and it's rainy all the time, but it's hot in the same time. 